Hi, my name is Keith Douglas from Fresh Group Products. Uh, today's video is just to run through a product that we call a PC450. Effectively, it's a self-propelled paddock cleaner. So the, the red part that you see on the top, this is a Trafalgar uh, PC300, we call it, as an individual product. Um, basically, that's the vacuum element of the machine, which is mounted and fitted onto a muck truck four-wheel drive power barrow. So, and that together is why we call it a PC450. So this is just gonna be to show you the operation of the product and how to use it and we'll demonstrate the suction and just run through the basic check. So first of all, uh, I'm gonna show you the tipping feature of the machine. So if the camera basically wants to come in, you can see there's two of these catches, one on each side okay and I'm just gonna if the camera can come up here you're gonna see that they line up and you just give it a good firm push and lock them in so now if the camera comes around to the front you can see this would obviously be full of poo horse manure or whichever animal it is okay so now if the camera goes out and um, this handle here is a skip release catch and this is the tipping handle so in this position is the ideal position you pull that that enables now for the skip to be emptied so basically the bin now can be tipped when you retract it when you finish it make sure with your left hand to just lift the hose out of the way and drop it back in i'll walk around the other side and i'll just clip the lid out so a firm pull and then you just remember to put these clips back in. I don't know if the camera's picking that up okay, but you just hook them over and clip them back. So that's how to tip the skip. So uh, with regards to the vacuum, I'll just pull it round so the camera can get a better view of the engine. So to show you how to start the engine, it's a Honda four-stroke engine, so it's petrol, um, just standard unleaded petrol. There's an on-off switch. So we switch that to the on, if the camera comes back round. This is the fuel line switched off. So when you're starting it and running it, it's on. But when you don't run the engine, please do remember to switch that to the off position. So, and then up here, if you can come, you can see this is the choke. And there is a symbol to show you an arrow with the choke on. So we put that into the on position. Now if you go back, to start it, I'm right handed, so I, the stance, correct stance is this way round with your feet and a hand anchor. Take up the biting point and give a firm pull. So I'm just going to switch the choke off. Um, it's quite a cold morning this morning, but you want to run the engine for three, four, five minutes um, to let this engine warm up. Um, if you put it onto full power when it's cold, it's likely to die on you and you'll need to restart it. So I'm just going to let that run for a bit. So now I'll turn the machine around a bit further. So you can see the pickup tool. Ideally, it's good to put the hose in this position when moving it. And then to lift it off and use it, you can run it around this way. So. The action of using the poo pick is to dab it on the manure, but to give you an idea, you can come round to these positions and be picking up everything that's in its place. Now I'm just running it on tick over just so that it doesn't drown out my voice. So what I will do is I'll start the muck truck which is on another video. While I'm doing this, the reason why I'm doing this, just to explain, is to show you the benefit now of you can come round and you can pick up more poos this side and keep coming round and doing. 
what you must never do is take the hose over that side of the tipping handle because you're likely to burn a hole in the hose because the exhaust is on this side of the engine so if the camera can pick that up basically there's the exhaust so do not take the hose over here always keep it on that side and then although I'm going a little bit out of shot you can see that we've pretty much made a circle of a cleaning area so a really good useful feature to point out with the PC450 so um, okay so now we're going to demonstrate the suction it's going to be quite difficult on the video but we'll do the best we can so on tick over so I'll bring it up to the mic you might be able to see but um, that's that's going to pick up leaves off a stony drive ideally without sucking up the stones and you can control the suction by increasing or decreasing the revs of the engine to suit. So now I'm going to take it up, not nowhere near full rev, but this would be not even half revs really, but basically that the camera might not pick it up, but it's, that's pulling my hand in quite a lot now, and that's going to be ideal for sucking up the dry poo in the summer basically where where the birds are scattered it okay now in the winter months the Trafalgar vacuums will suck up wet heavy poo out of long wet grass without constant blockages um, which is a known fault with what we would pass as dirty fan systems where the Trafalgar clean fan system um, because of the fan that we use as well which is in the general video of the paddock cleaners we demonstrate and show you how many extra blades or fins it has so now just hunt it a little bit you might not be able to hear me very well now but you can see the suction that that's holding so that's actually really trying to pull my hand in. I mean, you know, I can walk around and that's just my hand loosely in the tube. And you can see the suction that you're getting. So that's basically because of the fan system that we use uh, and no muck is going through the fan and that's why we sort of claim that it can pick up wet poos throughout 12 months of the year. It's brilliant for obviously all the other jobs which is sucking up any tree debris such as even fallen fruit, fallen apples but acorns if you've got oak trees, leaves, cones, kernels, you know, various things really. Um, cleaning out the bottom of water troughs, it's extremely good for that. Um, the loose hay around the hay nets, another great job it can do. And even because it's so light, um, if you've got cobwebs up in the stable yards, it's easy enough to get the cobwebs down. So it's got a, yes it is a poo picker primarily of course, and that's what it's bought for and sold as, but it, this clean fan system offers lots of extra benefits. Um, so that just really runs through the suction, the operation, how to empty it, how to start it. Um, there are other videos on maintenance checks on the engines and on the muck trucks. Um, but if you've got any other questions or interest in the product, my name's Keith Douglas from Fresh Group Products. Um, we're always here to take your call. Um, contact details are below this video if you're watching it on our YouTube channel. So thanks very much for watching. Hope you found that uh, video informative. Please subscribe to our channel or share with any friends or colleagues. And um, we will send future videos out via our channel and we hope you enjoy them. Thank you.